Um, I've been hearing a lot about this game. It's been highly recommended to me. I didn't expect to play this game, but uh, I'm going to assume that Solar is going to be starting up a crew. <laughs> Right click to scan objects. All right. So, uh, this is our ship. This is basically our hub area. Okay, so this is proximity chat. Nice. Good? Yes. It is actual proximity chat. <laughs> Anyways, go on. Okay, I don't... Uh, yeah, we're just gonna land here. So I will exp Well, that was gonna be explained. I will explain things as... No, I'll, I'll explain it once we actually land proper. Okay. Celestial okay. Body 41 so, experimentation. Currently, we are on an alien moon. So we are currently on an alien moon. This alien moon uh, has a facility that is over there. If you scan, you can see the main entrance. This facility has a bunch of crap inside it. Our job is to go inside and get that crap and bring it back to our ship so that we can sell it for profit. All we right. are basically Amazon employees. <laughs> That's what this game is, huh? Ah, there you go, all the way over there. More or less. All right, so we're gonna just... Oh, I'm guessing you went inside. Oh, there we go. So I have to like right. hold it down when entering. Anyways. Yep. All right, so this is the facility. Um, it's procedurally generated, so it's a different layout every time. Uh, right here is our first piece of scrap. There's a big bolt. All right. That's one of the things. That's the landmine in there, so don't go in there. All right then. Also, I love that there's uh, like a cool echo in this uh, in the areas. Yeah, it's nice. I yeah. can hear another one somewhere. It is very dark, but if you scan, you can briefly light up the hallways a little bit. Uh, you're gonna want to check the floors and also the ceilings, but the scanner will tell you uh, if there is an object that you can sell for scrap or uh, something else. All right then. Just be aware, you and I are not the only things that can hear us. Oh, so there's like other uh, other uh, entities that don't want to be that we don't want to be around. More or less. All right, so that was basically a big fucking circle. <laughs> is this locked? It is not. Okay. All right. Wait, I thought I saw something here. Oh, those are just cables. All right. Uh, it's a dead end up there. There's nothing in here. All right, then. There's probably another... Yeah, there's a one more path to Qu the right side. Question, is there fall damage? Uh, yes. Okay, all right. So it's a good thing I didn't jump off the rails to try to get down the next floor. Well, I mean, the fall damage isn't that extreme. There are things that you can... Oh, there's a key up here. Hang on, let me check around here, and... Nope, nothing. Alright. There's like a server room in here. Ah, d come on. Come on. There we go. Oh, this a circuit. This contains nothing. Yeah, it's just oh, a bunch of... Wait. There's a sheet here. Alright, cool. Also, uh... Oh, there's another one. Nice. So you haven't been... You, you haven't been picking stuff up, so you wouldn't know this yet, but, uh... This stuff does have weight, and that weight affects your stamina and how quickly it drains. All right. So our goal is we are trying to meet our profit quota of uh, 130, which honestly, I think with this, we might have already met. It's hmm. not that big of a, it's not that big of a, a deal. Oh! On the first day. Did you take damage? Yeah, ouch. Uh, yeah, so, um, in order to do that, what I, to, to avoid that, what I do is when I jump off, I just kind of Skyrim slide my way down the side. Fair. 
Yeah, you just you just hug the side of the wall as you're going down. That usually negates most fall damage, if not all of it. What's with the time flying by so fast? Each day is approximately... It's about 10 minutes, roughly. Um, is that just a game mechanic, or does that have to do with the, um, the cycle of the uh, moon we're on? Um, both. Both? Okay. So the ship automatically leaves at midnight, and... Uh, and we get here at like I think like eight, roughly. All right. Like eight in the morning, and it leaves at midnight. So we have just a little over twelve hours to get all the stuff. Less than that, but it's almost all, two. But go ahead. But all told, it's like about ten minutes of real time. Okay. Um. Hang on. I'm trying to find yep. I'm guessing he went in here. Solar? Shit, I think we got separated. Okay. Uh, let me head back out. Where the hell did you go? I thought he went back inside or something. Did he go over here? No, he's not in that crevice. Alright, um... There's no way I can, like, let him know where I'm at because I'm currently, like... I'm way too, like... I don't even know how to say it. I'm guessing I used up my stamina? Yeah, I did. I used up my stamina. Or maybe he did go in there and I just looked in a different spot. Can't be here for too long. Obviously, we would have to be at the ship by 8, he said. Unless the... The hour is something different. Okay, I don't like that eeriness. This is making me uncomfortable. Where the hell did he go? Perhaps for the moment, unmute on Discord and let him know you're lost. Um... Actually, can I pause? Hang on. Okay, so, um... Oh, wait, he's also deafened. Now that's not gonna work. Alright, it's almost 5pm. Um... Shit. 5.10. Uh, it's getting dark out. Maybe I need to go back in the ship. Maybe he went back there, too. Is there a safe way to drop this time? I can't waste too much time. You know what? I might as well just do that. I just hope I don't leave him or anything. Okay, come on. Can I not go down there? Okay, at least there wasn't any fall damage. Did I hear steps right just now? Um, am I even going the right way? This is going to be a heavy learning curve. Okay, I need to find the ship and I need to find it fast. I think I went the wrong way. I cannot see diddly squat. Wait, maybe that's the ship. Hi. Wait, where were you? I've been trying to find you. I've been in the ship. Okay. Oh, I had to go through here. All right, there you are. Yeah, I don't know what happened. We got just randomly, we got separated. Oh, it's a good thing that we got out of there just as we did, because there's something outside the ship. I can hear it. Yeah, like, I saw that it was getting dark. I'm like, you know what? Maybe I need to go back in the ship. Probably. Okay, yeah, <laughs> so we didn't make quota, but that's fine. We had three days to do that, and um, honestly, the first quota is not that big of a deal anyways. All right.
sustain the most injuries. Um, okay. It's probably the, the you what? broke your legs on re-entry. How is it that you're ranked as the laziest employee when you found more stuff than I have? I don't know how that I, works. I think it's something to do with, uh, with, like, how much you're standing still. Oh. Okay, yeah, this balloon's fine. I don't think then. Yeah, so occasionally the moons will have different weather patterns that will affect how difficult it is to get back. Um, there aren't any on this one yet, but I did see a couple of other moons that had them. Um, they don't like increase your score or anything like that, unfortunately. So it's usually best to just avoid them, but sometimes like all of them will have a shitty modifier and you just have to pick the lesser of two evils. All right then. By far the worst one is eclipsed because it, eclipsed means so like after a certain time like hostile monsters will start spawning outside and eclipsed means they, they just spawn immediately because it basically acts like it's already night all right are there any flashlights uh, there are, but we are poor currently. Alright, so we would have to obtain them first? We would, we have to, unfortunately our employee Amazon benefits do not come with flashlights. Yeah, well that yeah. sucks. That's it's very spooky in here, that door is locked. Alright then. That is a sealed hydraulic door. There is out. Oh, hey, look, we just walked around it. That is a dead end. All right. Wow, this place is empty. Got nothing. Okay, yeah. That? Oh, sorry. Okay, I'm hearing eerie sounds. Yeah, that's the, uh, the power, I think. Okay. It's down here. Do any- are any of these flipped off? No, they're all on. Alright, so I'm guessing we're going back upstairs, or...? Yeah. Right. And try to find more. Hang on, do I see scratch marks on the screen? Uh... Yeah, that's your that's your helmet. It's uh, it's not very well maintained. Ah, okay, that's a dead end. Okay, um, how do we tell the time? Uh, inside we can't. Oh shit! So we could like be, so, we could be in here and like for days and not even know it. There's a landmine. All right. You'll be able to see it flashing occasionally, but yeah. All right, then. There is fucking nothing in here. Oh, hang on. Big bolt. Ah. Well, is there we found something. Downstairs. There is not. All right, then. I'm... Also, uh... Oh, hey. There we go. Hang Large on. Large axle. All right. Cool beans. Holy hell. That yeah, thing is... it's large, all right. It's bigger than you. Alright, um, I think the exit was this way. Alright. So yeah, the bigger stuff slows you down more, but it is generally worth more as well, so. Alright. Also, the bigger stuff you, uh... Oh, okay, this is locked. Hang on a second. Shit. There we go. I have a, uh, I have a key. Whoops, sorry. Oh, hey, okay, um... So that thing... That thing's worth a lot of money. But if we take it out, uh, the power will go out, and uh, the, we may run into monsters more often. Uh, so maybe come back later? I mean, we can honestly probably head out now. Well, that's if you know the way, because with the power going out, you can't see. Well, yeah, but that thing also glows. No, no sorry. God damn it! Sorry. <laughs> oh, hey. What? I think we had our first encounter. A first encounter? Okay. 
uh, yeah, we need to start fucking thinking about finding an exit here soon. Because I imagine we're starting to get to the point where things are spawning in, and not all of them are friendly. In fact, very few of them are. Alright, Heather, there's nothing back here. There's no map function here? Nope. Oh, you Christ. You gotta navigate by the seat of your pants and your wits. Oh, God. Also, you're going to want to keep an eye on the ceiling. Alright. And also the ground, because uh, sometimes there's landmines and sometimes there's other things that are on the ceiling and not so savory. Alright. Hey, look, landmine. Oh, hey. There's a friend. Oh, wait, that might actually be the exit up ahead. I hope so. Hey, hey, um, remember what I said? Some things are not so... Ooh, I almost walked right into that. Yeah, let's back away. Hang on, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do some MLG Pro Gamer strats here. Uh, be careful. Yeah, you might want to think about uh, making some room. All right, now where's this? Oh, hi. Oh, it's coming to me. Yeah. I don't want to go that way, and I don't want to go that way. Oh, it's getting closer. Yeah, you gotta make some distance here. All right. Hydro Deary. Am I able to jump over this thing? Oh. Uh, well, I tried. Did you head downstairs? Uh, no. Oh shit, it's coming back. Oh shit! Oh crap. Oh! Oh, what the hell? Get off of me! Get off me! Fuck! <laughs> uh, so great day too. Yeah. So first I see your dead body, and then I'm like, oh, well, I, I guess I have to find my own way out. Then all of a sudden, ambush. So here's the really fun part. Uh huh. Um, we both died. So all no our shit. Crap's gone. Which means we have one day left to gather our entire prof. <laughs> you know what? We're gonna change moons here. <laughs> I like that magical star who was like, I had money on Fox Nine first. Well, you lost the bet. How does it feel? So this moon is different. Okay. Uh, the, way to the, the way to the facility is a little different, but I think this place also has higher loot, so we should be able to secure a better profit here. Alright. Also, it is slightly more dangerous. Who the fuck farted? One me. Oh. Sound alerts. I think Drog found the uh, sound alerts, like... I don't remember even installing it. Huh. Pranked. Essentially took about an hour. Oh, not an hour. Half an hour. Get to here. Oh, hey, wow. That's a fucking... That's very fortunate, actually. What'd you find? Uh, I found the thingy that I mentioned earlier that uh, drains the power. It's, like, literally right next to the entrance. Oh. So, we could just. Whenever we're, yeah, whenever we're ready to leave. Oh, there's a turret in here. A turret? Wow. That is precarious. Yeah, don't go in there. It, uh, it'll it shoot you. I'm going to run across to the other side and see if there's anything in there. <sighs> Come on. Ooh, yes. Score. 
If it is hopping yeah. around happily. Oh no! Oh j Jesus! So I found where this. Uh, the Almost forgot player. Prime sub time. Thank you, Blue Griffin. All right. All right. Uh, good news. As secured our prop. Let's All get right. the fuck out of here. Yeah, so stick close to me because this thing glows. Um, ignore that radiation warning. It doesn't actually mean anything. All right. What it does mean, though, is that some things might start spawning very quickly. So let's, let's get the fuck out of here. Yeah, I agree. All right, so. Good news. Yeah, I found basically our entire profit in basically that room there. So that was, uh, that was pretty good luck on our part. All right, then. You will be surprised. Uh, some objects are worth a lot more than you would think. All right, then.